today we'll discuss few more properties of graphs i mentioned about simple graph in my last class simple graph is a graph which has no self loops and there are no parallel edges next is finite graph finite graph is a graph in which number of edges and number of vertices are finite now in this graph suppose i have a vertex v2 which is adjacent to vertex v1 and adjacent to vertex v3 now i am calling these two edges e1 and e2 are adjacent because of this vertex v2 so two they are non parallel edges therefore two non parallel edges are adjacent if they are incident on a common vertex two non parallel edges e1 and e2 are incident on a common vertex v2 therefore i am calling these two edges e1 and e2 as adjacent to each other i can call these two vertices as uh, adjacent to each other since they are the vertices of a same edge next what um, if any in general if i take any vertex vi and an edge ej if this vertex vi is a end vertex of some edge ej then we call them vi and ej we call these two as incident to each other any vertex vi is an end vertex of some edge ej then we call vi comma ej as incident to each other now next definition is degree degree of a vertex or and degree of a graph in this graph in this graph if i consider i can look at this vertex v1 i can say there is only one edge connected to this vertex for vertex v2 there are two edges for the vertex v3 there is only one edge the degree of a graph a degree of a vertex means the number of incidents on the vertex with self loop counted twice means suppose i have graph this is v1 v2 vertex v3 now here uh, i want to have degree of v1 degree means degree of a vertex means how many edges are incident on this vertex that gives me degree for this vertex number of edges uh, incident on this vertex is 1 so degree of v1 is 1 for this vertex v2 how many edges are incident on this vertex v2 that is 2 so degree of v2 is 2 now degree of v3 is one edge is this e1 e2 e3 let me name the edges so one edge is e2 and another edge is e3 but by definition i have to consider self loops as twice so this one is one edge and another one and one more here so degree of v3 is 3 so degree of a graph is number of incidents on a vertex on a particular vertex with self loops counted twice then we can say the degree of the vertex for any vertex i have to count how many edges are incident on that that gives me degree if there is a self loop then i have to count it twice total degree of a graph
it's nothing but sum of all the degrees of our vertices which is actually equal to twice the number of edges if e is the number of edges then total degree of a graph is 2 into e because you can observe each edge contributes 2 degree to the graph because this is for this vertex 1 degree and for this vertex 1 degree so each edge contributes 2 degree to the graph therefore total degree of a graph is twice the number of edges each edge contributes 2 so 2 into e now how many edges are there in simple graph of n vertices if graph is n and graph has n number of vertices and e number of edges then what is the maximum number of edges in the graph g i mentioned in my last class it is n into n minus 1 by 2 so total degree of a graph is 2 into e that is 2 into n minus 1 into n by 2 so which is nothing but n into n minus 1 so for total degree of a graph is nothing but m into n minus 1 Next is the theorem, which states that number of vertices of odd degree in a graph is always an even number. See, in a graph, there are the vertices which has degree odd, odd num, odd degree. There are the vertices are of even degree. Now, the state theorem states that. the number of vertices having odd degree is an even number say i am considering set of vertices say vk this vk represents all the vertices of my graph all vertices okay and i'll take up say vi this these are the vertices which has odd degree odd degree vertices and say vj these are all the vertices which has uh, even degree okay i'll consider odd degree vertices and even degree vertices separately now we can express total degree of a graph total degree of a graph as sum of two or uh, sum of these two that means sum of odd degree vertices plus sum of even degree vertices so total degree and total degree of a graph i mean total degree of a graph i'll write it like this summation d of vk means sum of the degrees of all the vertices that means a total degree of a graph which is nothing but sum of the degrees of odd degree vertices plus sum of the degrees of even degree vertices okay now i know total degree of a graph is nothing but 2 into e total degree of a graph is nothing but 2 into e because each edge contributes degree 2 to the graph so left hand side is 2e okay now and this is sum of all the degrees of the vertices which has an even degree therefore this 2e this is sum into d of vi plus this is degrees uh, sum of the degrees of even degree vertices which is an even number because each degree is an even number therefore when i take 
dasam that is also an even number so 2e minus an even number gives me sum of the degrees of odd degree vertices since each d of vi is an odd number to uh, that give that should give me sum as an even number therefore this has to be an even number so how many should be there degree is odd but how many times i should add them that means i should add even number of times so that i'll get an even number i repeat this together gives me an even number okay each dvi is odd number so there is some giving me an even number therefore this has to be an even number therefore i am saying the number of vertices of odd degree in a graph is also an even number